Hi, my name is Matthew, and I went on the IROP to MIT in the summer of 2019. I was placed in the camera culture group of the MIT Media Lab, where I worked on non-line-of-sight localization of objects, which basically means trying to see around corners and predict where an object is without being able to see it. Whilst I was there, I got a taste of what living in another culture was like, learned a lot about the local area's history, and even got a chance to get out of Boston and visit the surrounding area. To briefly go into more detail about my work, I developed a demonstration of an algorithm, which the group had already made for looking around corners. First I optimized it, then I added a part which measured the true location of the object, and finally I added some robotics to automate the experiment process. The really important part of that was measuring the real location of the object, as we could compare that to the predicted location to measure the performance of the algorithm. Then, once we were able to measure its effectiveness, I carried out loads of experiments showing the performance of the algorithm in different scenarios, like when the corridor was different shapes, or when there was clutter in the corridor blocking the camera's view. What was really exciting about all that was not only did it perform surprisingly well, but we were able to collect a huge amount of data to verify that. And now all that data is being used to write a paper, which I'm going to be a co-author of. And that in itself feels like such a huge accomplishment, definitely beyond what I thought I'd achieve when I started this placement. Outside of work, there are still a lot of things which made this trip really amazing. It was my first time in the US, so there were loads of really exciting things to see and differences that I didn't expect. I thought there would be a few big differences between Boston and the UK, but in fact there were lots of small things, like all the food is a bit sweeter and larger, and credit cards are almost always swiped instead of using PIN or contactless. The big highlights of the trip for me were visiting New York, including going up to the top of the Rockefeller Center, getting to know everyone in the lab, especially the other Europe students who I sat with, and of course my supervisor Tristan and going to MIT's gymnastics classes, which were free and on a Wednesday. I can't express the gratitude I have for being given the opportunity to take part in this program. It's certainly an experience I will remember for the rest of my life. Thank you to the International Relations Office at Imperial, the International Students Office at MIT, and of course, all the members of the Camera Culture Group for making my time there so memorable.